it's time for a daily dose of victory, even if it's just a minute with the pastor. Hey, I'm Pastor Tony Smith, the pastor of Victorious Ministry. This is another daily dose of victory. We are five days away from Father's Day. Please make that a special day for any male in your life that's been a blessing to you or have strived to become the best father that they could be under the limitations and the situations they're in. Today we're on the subject, making the wrong right. I wanna to talk to you about making things right, dealing with your finances. I know that you can choose to pay off or spend anything you want to spend dealing with what you have, but I want you to consider making the right thing, doing the right thing with your rent, doing the right thing to pay your rent, doing the right thing to pay your bills that are, are, are overwhelming or in front of you today. I want you to not to be uh, uh, in a position where you always take and never pay back. Um, do the right thing concerning your finances. Um, I know you don't care what people think because you're benefiting, but you must need to care because sometime in life you'll get down so hard that when people need to care about you, they won't because they consider what you have done to them when you should have cared. I want to encourage you to consider Father's Day and to begin to salute um, great men around you and let them know that they are cared for, loved, and appreciated, appreciated by you recognize it. Take a text, do a dial phone call, and let them know that they are celebrated on that day. Hey, I'm Pastor Tony. I just stopped for a moment to encourage all men, calling all men for a weekend, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Um, Father's Day weekend, on Father's Day to come and join us, to empower you, to give you some direction of who to be, how to become greater men, and to be recognized that this is the weekend of Father's Day. So I'm encouraging you all to be a part of Father's Day, joining us at the conference, men's conference at Victorious Ministry in Baltimore. Bye-bye.